Hello. I thought I'd share another story. Um, it's really hot and there's not much else to do. I'm just kind of sitting here in the pool. Um, please excuse the cicadas. Cicadas. They're really loud. Um, anyway, so this story is like, it's from like two years ago or something. Not that long ago. Um, Andrew and I were 20. Um, it was like one summer's afternoon. We were sitting there watching Top Gear. We used to watch Top Gear a lot. And we'd been watching Top Gear for a while. And then Andrew goes, I need a poo. And I was like, I also need a poo. And then we kind of discussed. And I was like, my poo's pretty big, so maybe you should go first. Because otherwise you'll have to kind of sit in the, in the smell. Um, I'm really kind now that I think about it. Anyways, so Andrew goes and poos, and I'm there watching Top Gear. Um, and I was like, ooh, Andrew's taking a while. Eventually, Andrew gets back, and he's like, Jordan, there's a problem. And I was like, what's happened? And he's like, well, just before, just before I tell you this, um, I... I'm a firm believer in having purchased a plunger before you need one. Like, I've told Andrew this specifically many times, and I've made this clear to a lot of my colleagues and acquaintances and friends even. But um, anyways, Andrew goes, Jordan, I've clogged the toilet. And I was like, oh no. Andrew, do you have a plunger? And he goes, no. Um, and we kind of sat there for a bit and we're like, what should we do? Eventually, we decided that what we should do is for me to then do my poo and maybe my poo would push down Andrew's poo and it would all be fine. In hindsight, that wasn't the best solution, but that's what we decided. Um, so anyways, Andrew sits down and watches um, Top Gear and we kind of like tag out and I go and go to the toilet. Um, anyways. After a bit, I come back and Andrew's still watching Top Gear. And I'm like, Andrew, we have a problem. And Andrew's like, oh no. Then what happened? And I was like, come here. <laughs> Andrew's toilet's really small. It's like this really small room. Andrew's family's pretty small as well. It's really cute. Um, but we go into Andrew's toilet <laughs> and there's just this just lots of poos in the toilet um, and we're just there looking at the poo like oh no and then there's a bit of silence for a bit and we're just like and Andrew goes should we get the adults involved <laughs> we were like 20 <laughs> um, anyways we eventually ended up searching <laughs> Andrew's garden for the biggest stick we can find and somehow managed to like kind of poke the poos down into the toilet and unclog the toilet but the moral of the story is make sure you buy you have a plunger before you need one because otherwise that happens um hope you enjoyed the story see you later